Uh, the volcano uh, is now erupting outside of the crater again. And as you can see, it's flowing toward the uh, uh, south and the east side, as you can see here. So the flow pattern is back to normal. In a way, you can see that the water is spilling uh, of the lava toward the uh, uh, outside is happening now. It's not just going through a conduit to lava tubes disappearing. So that's a big development now. The, but I have to observe yet to see if the cycle of the pattern is the same as before or has changed. We can see now the big eruption is now coming. Unfortunately, those videos that we, we could see, uh, those scenes that we could see the people gathering around the volcano and having those massive lava falls uh, in the background, that can be difficult now because all those hills that were available by then to the hikers are not just little islands in the lava. And uh, the only way to go there, and because of this uh, uh, existence of too much gas, is difficult now, is by helicopter. And even with the helicopter, I'm not sure that it's safe to do it now. So probably our best chances are now with the drones. Uh, drones or helicopters over the volcano uh, without actually landing or heliboarding or any port of the hills around. You have also to avoid the prevailing wind. The wind is now coming from the north, as you can see in this image, in this video. So they're coming from the north. It's difficult to actually capture that. And uh, if you if you are uh, capture those, uh, as you can see, the helicopter is coming from the north. Yeah, they, that way you can avoid the gases and the steams that are coming. There can be you know all kind of gases, uh, sulfur compounds and uh, carbon compounds, CO two, and lots of water also. And uh, sometimes you can see even the yellow patches. Those are sulfur actually deposited there, pure elemental sulfur. Uh, anyway, this is a new development. We can see now the lava is pouring out non-stop. If there is any cycle that we can say that is uh, periodic, like the way it was 7 to 12 minute periodic lava eruptions, is now changed to continuous lava uh, pouring. It can be because of the reduction in the height of the conduit, so it's just all the time the pool is being leaked, leaking. The, the lava pool is leaking outside continuously, or it can be just because the, the uh, nature of the mag magma chamber has changed and it can provide a continuous supply of the lava. So this is the latest development, and uh, um, I hope that you will enjoy watching the rest of this. If you are planning to go to Iceland, yeah, don't forget if you can get a drone, get a drone. <laughs>